Hey Credit Warriors, Credit Shifu here, and today what we're going to do is a little bit different. We're going to be talking about cashback cards, but I'm sure everyone already knows about the Chase Freedom, the Discover It, the City Double Cash. So today we are going to be looking at some of the lesser known cashback cards uh, that are on the market in 2018. And we are going to start off with the Alliant Visa Signature Card. Now this card has quite a special sort of sign up bonus in that, you know, they don't just give you a lump sum, it's a 3% cash back on all purchases for the first year. Uh, and then after that, it goes down to 2.5% on all purchases. So there are no categories on this card. It's very simple. Uh, and it's just 3% cash back for the first year, 2.5% after that. Now this card, they say on their website that it is designed specifically for people who spend over $50,000 on a card per year. Um, I looked in the terms and conditions. I didn't find any spending requirement that you have to spend a certain amount on the card though, um, but I guess they've just designed that with you know these sorts of people in mind. Uh, and they apparently give generous credit limits. Now a friend of mine actually got this card specifically to make one big purchase and that was buying a red cinema camera. Like these are the cameras that they use on some Hollywood movies. And it costs at least, I don't know, fifteen to twenty thousand dollars, okay? Um, I forget which model he bought, but it's actually in that it's in that range, right? Fifteen to twenty thousand. Uh, and so yeah, he he looked around uh, for credit cards and he said that he actually got uh, this card, which, uh, you know, was the best for the purchase that he was going to make, I assume, because of the generous credit line, okay, because obviously his credit line would have to be at least, you know, over $20,000, right? Uh, and then that 3% cash back in the first year. So if you made a purchase uh, of $20,000, uh, you'd actually be getting $600 back uh, on that purchase. So I say he did pretty well. Now, just a couple of other final notes about this card. There are no foreign transaction fees. And there's also a $59 annual fee uh, that is waived for the first year. And this card comes from the Alliant Credit Union. Uh, it won some awards uh, this year, I believe, for being one of the best uh, cashback cards. So definitely a strong choice. Next, we have the US Bank Cash Plus Visa Signature Card. Now, if you live in New York City, you're probably not familiar with US Bank, I mean, at least not so much. We don't see US Bank branches around in New York City at all. Um, but they are actually one of the biggest banks in the US. I believe they're top four. They're huge in the middle of the country. Uh, and so yes, this is the Cash Plus Visa Signature Card from US Bank. Let's have a look at some of the benefits of this card. So this card um, has some similarities with the Chase Freedom and the Discover It card. Uh, but in my opinion, for a cashback card, it actually beats them. So it has quarterly categories, but you actually choose two categories yourself each quarter. And in those two categories, you can get 5% back on $2,000 worth of spending. Now the Chase Freedom, Discover It, it's $1,500 uh, worth of spending and you don't choose the categories yourself. The bank chooses them and they rotate. This one, you choose the categories yourself and you can spend up to $2,000 and get 5% back and then it goes down to 1%. In addition to that, you also get a permanent 2% category um, of your choice. It's an everyday category. So you have to choose one of the everyday categories and they give an example is like supermarkets. Um, so yeah, you have a few to choose from for that 2% as well. And then on everything else, you earn just 1%. Now this card has no annual fee. It does have a traditional signup bonus of $150 and it also gives 0% APR on balance transfers uh, for the first 12 months of billing cycles. So you have a balance transfer component to this card if you're in debt on another card and you want to transfer your balance over and pay no interest while you're paying it off that's an, op uh, an option for you with this card as well. Now for our next card we have the Costco Anywhere Visa. Now I'm sure you guys probably have actually heard of the Costco cards. They are reasonably popular but sometimes overlooked when we're talking about cashback cards. People often think just about the Freedom Discover It City Double Cash, the usual suspects. Um, but the Costco Anywhere Visa, so you have to be a Costco member for this. Um, there's my membership card. Um, but the card does have some pretty cool earning of cashback. You get 4% back on up to $7,000 worth of gas purchases per year. So this is a really good gas card. And I think probably most people aren't going to spend more than $7,000 a year on gas, unless you're like, I don't know, Dom from Fast and Furious. I'm green. I'm going for it.
in addition to that, um, it gets you 3% back on uh, restaurants and travel, 2% back at Costco and at Costco.com, which is what it's co-branded with, uh, and then 1% back on everything else. And there's no annual fee on this card, but like we said, you do have to be a Costco member, which will cost you uh, $60 a year for the basic membership. So you could say that the annual fee is um, $60, since you do actually have to be a member and it's a members only card. Uh, the card also serves as your ID card for Costco, so you won't have to take this extra membership card. You just bring that credit card that you're gonna pay with uh, and that's it. And they do have a few extra benefits uh, that are for members only. Now for our final card, uh, and this is the Wells Fargo Cashwise card. Now, this card has a few distinct features that are quite interesting. So you get 1.8% cash back on mobile wallet purchases for the first year. Um, and then otherwise, other than that, the card just earns 1.5% cash back on everything. So after the first year, that mobile wallet category will go down to 1.5% as well. Now I know that's not the highest category of cash back because we've looked at you know 4% or 5% even with the, the uh, US bank card. Um, but mobile wallet purchases is uh, a distinct category. So I wanted to have a card with that. But this CashWise card also has a few other features. So there's a $200 sign up bonus, which is about as high as it gets really with cash back cards. There's $600 cell phone protection uh, insurance with a $25 deductible. Now, not a lot of cards have that, so that's, uh, that's a pretty good feature. Uh, and in addition to that, there is no annual fee and you also get 12 months of introductory 0% APR on purchases and on balance transfers. So this could be a card that if you're in debt elsewhere, you transfer your balance over to it, pay no interest. Or if you want to fund a big purchase like a new sofa or something, you could do that on this card and then pay it off over 12 months paying no interest. Do be careful with things like that though. I don't want you guys to get into debt. We always encourage responsible spending. So guys, if you like the look of any of these uh, cashback cards, do have a look in the links below. We've posted the link to uh, some of the top cashback cards from our partners at creditcards.com. Uh, most of the cards we've talked about today are included uh, in that web page uh, and actually there are some extra ones as well that we haven't covered so if you want to browse cards and, and compare them uh, that's definitely a good place to do it obviously these are affiliate links so you know it does help out the show if you use them for your applications uh, and we thank you if you do do that you can of course always just search directly for the names of these cards and do it your own way uh, up to you guys uh, thank you so much for watching guys don't forget if you are new please subscribe and hit that notifications button so you never miss a video uh, leave your comments below as well if you have one of these cards or you're thinking of getting it or if you have any questions uh, we'd love to hear from you as always we will see you next time with more credit card tips and tricks bye bye yeah.